Hello to you. Welcome to Adelante Chicago. Bienvenidos. I'm Lourdes Duarte. Thank you so much for joining us today. Let's begin with a special program that's giving students a helping hand with what can be a very difficult process. The program is called Chicago Scholars, and it gives college-bound students the tools to succeed in higher education. So joining us to explain about all this, we've got two people, Dominique Jordan-Turner. She is the president and CEO of Chicago Scholars Foundation. There she is. And then the lady right next to her, the young lady right next to her, Olivia Villarreal, who has been through the Chicago Scholars Program. Thank you to both of you for coming in. Thank you for Thank having you. us. I'm excited yeah. about this program because anytime you can help students get through, get to college and get through college, I think mm -hmm. it's a wonderful mm -hmm. thing. Uh, so how did this get started? I'm going to start with you. How did this get, where did the idea come mm -hmm. from that you needed to pair students up with, you know, some financial aid help, a mentor, things like that? Really good question, Lourdes. It's important to note that nationally, just 9% of low-income students will actually graduate from college within six years. And so that's the base of it all. We work with that same student population. And as a result of our mentoring and our leadership development and college access work, 86% of our students are graduating with a college degree. And I see a lot of programs where maybe they get kids to college, but sometimes they don't follow them yeah. through the process. And I think that's key because there's a lot that happens in those four years that could set you off course. Absolutely. We're a unique seven-year mentor model. And so we not only get students to college, we see to it that they persist, graduate, and most importantly, return back to Chicago to begin their careers as leaders. And so we want to make sure that they finish what they started. Okay, so let's hear Olivia's story right here. She's smiling, so it's got to be a good one. I know that. Um, so you hooked up with Chicago Scholars. How? How did they come to you or did you go to them? Actually, it was my mom. Uh, she went to a Chicago, uh, college fair at Farragut High School, and she picked up an application. Chicago Scholars had a booth, and she brought home the application, and she handed it to me to fill out. Um, she's very community-orientated, uh, and she just knew that this would be a very beneficial resource for me since I would be the first one to go away to college. In your family, you yes. are the first person to go yes, to college. Yes, I was. Mm -hmm. Wow. Parents have to be very proud. They are, they are, but we wouldn't have been able to done it without Chicago Scholars. They provided numerous, countless opportunities, um, starting with workshops, which revolved around how to fill out a college application, uh, fee waivers, um, how to uh, navigate which college you want to apply to, and how to figure out what career choice and skills you want to build while you're away in college. So when you came to them, you didn't even have an idea of what you wanted to do if, you, if and when you went away to college, right? I had some idea. Um, that's the thing about Chicago Scholar students. We have some idea. And even when you get to college, sometimes your mind changes. Um, but Chicago Scholars really guides you all the way through, through those changes and helping you figure out um, what you want to do with your life. So you can come back to Chicago and give back um, through your career, but also through mentorship, um, currently mentoring students. So are you mentoring students yourself right now? Yes. Wow. Yes. This is my second year. I highly recommend it. It's a really beautiful experience. You provide the student support, um, helping them fill out the college application, how to write a personal statement, and how to figure out which college is right for you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's a good way to pay it forward. It's mm. a good mm. way to pay it forward. We were looking at some video there because you do one big event, and I'm going to get back to your story uh, in just a second, Olivia, but I want to talk about this big event that you do every year. It's at Navy Pier. You just had it, I think it was last week. Last week. How did it get so ah. big? Because you've got, like, <laughs> uh, what is it, hundreds of colleges it that show up there and powerful. partner up with the students, right? Absolutely. So this year was our biggest ever. We grew out of every space in Chicago and had to go to Navy <laughs> wow. Pier. We had 148 colleges from across the country, almost 900 students, and over 5,000 interviews happened on that particular day. Most of our scholars walked away with an admission to at least one college. Wow. And this is before anybody else in Chicago or the nation for that matter and so it is a game changer it boosts their confidence in such a way that they can uh, just sit back and rake in the rest of uh, the missions coming in amazing and you is this your fifth year in the program how many or did you um, already get through it and you're on the other end of it right I, that's correct I joined in 2006 so you did it for all seven years yes yeah. I mm -hmm. did uh, I joined it for 2006 when I was a junior in high school and um, after that year, they help you apply to college, and they're with you through the four years of college, mm -hmm. or however much time it takes you. Sometimes it takes you five years, mm -hmm. um, or depending on the program you pick. 
And then after that, they help you select a career. They offer you career workshops. Um, they help you meet professional mentors. So they're really there with you basically your entire and life. And what, what are you doing now, Olivia? <laughs> right now, I'm currently a student in the medical billing and coding program at the National Latino Education Institute. Um, Chicago Scholars really just helps you embrace whatever career goals you have. Um, they're really that positive reinforcement that everyone really needs. But as a minority myself, those um, those role models are not always at home or yeah. or in your neighborhood. And Chicago Scholars make sure that those role models are in your life. Okay. So I really appreciated that from the program. That's great. What was the toughest part you think throughout those seven years as you you know graduated high school, went on to college, as you said, the first one in your family, mm -hmm. and now you get out into the real world and you're trying to look for a job. I mean. Um, I would say the hardest part of it all was just being away from home, especially being the first one to go away. You kind of mm -hmm. feel kind of alone, but Chicago Scholars makes you feel like you're not alone and they're always there supporting you. And they're, if you have any questions and when you're confused in it all, they're a phone call away. And you have a mentor, a specific mentor designated just for you, right? Yeah, that's correct. Um, the mentoring program that I'm currently mentoring in uh, is about seven students and three, two to three mentors are assigned for those seven kids and um, you work with the students, you're at monthly workshops, and the mentors are also there through email for the personal statement writing, but also to help you select uh, which financial aid package uh, works for you best. Mm -hmm. um, and even after, advice for your resume, it's just professional advice for a lifetime. Okay, great, mm -hmm. that's wonderful. Uh, obviously, it's a great program. Uh, I know a lot of kids would love to be a part of it. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, not every student gets, gets the help. Yeah. Um, how do they apply and what are the requirements? How likely is a student to get into the program? Yeah. It's perfect timing, actually. We just released the application for the next class. So if you're a junior in high school right now, you are qualified. You have to have a minimum of a 3.0 GPA. But what's most important is that we, lo we look for leadership, those non-cognitive skills. We want students who have a growth mindset, who have faced obstacles and pushed mm -hmm. through them. And so we know that that's not only successful uh, that's not only necessary for college, but it's also necessary for life. Okay. What are you noticing within the Latino community, the African American community, in terms of kids moving on and going to college and how essential this help can be? Mm. It is a growing number every year. Um, our application pool has grown every year, and so we're seeing the success in students like Olivia who are the first, and they come back and they motivate their sisters and brothers and folks in their community. And so uh, she's critical, and other students like Olivia are critical to our success um, to motivate that next Thank generation. You. Yeah. Well, good luck to you, Olivia. We're Thank very you. proud of you. Thanks so much, Lourdes. Thank All you. Right. Uh, let's get the information up on the screen. There it is, where you can get uh, that application. Mm -hmm. If you have a student who you think could benefit from this program, it's chicagoscholars.org. Again, they are accepting applications right now for the next group of students that will come in for the upcoming year. So good luck. Thank you. Thank right. you.